if you have a bad knee and you go to the orthopedic surgeon, he's going to give you some options. He does a big workup. He's going to do a very extensive and very expensive workup for sure. Going to include an MRI or CT scan, some plain films, maybe some blood work. And he is going to give you some options for treating your knee symptoms, your knee inflammation. And the first line of defense he would give you would be, depending on the kind of cause of the damage and the, and the time it's been damaged already, time frame, uh, the first option would be put you on crutches. He'd say, all right, well, you had an athletic injury and I don't see anything broken and I don't see the meniscus torn. And I think if you get on these crutches for a couple of weeks, it'll probably take care of it. So, uh, and if you get on the crutches, he will promise you the pain will go away. Why? Because you're not loading the knee. You will not be loading the knee. You're taking the load off the knee, which takes the load off the inflammatory inflamed tissues around the chronic inflammation, and it won't hurt while you are walking with crutches. The second line of defense would be drugs, and there are various drugs, non-steroidals, narcotics. Um, fortunately, the orthopedic colleagues don't use neuroleptics and suppressives and stuff like that, which unfortunately, there's a bunch of TMD gurus who promote that kind of stuff using these very damaging, one way or another, drugs on TMD, but the but the second line of defense for a knee problem would be drugs of various kinds, non-steroidals, which work very well on chronic inflammation, but only a short period of time. What are non-steroidals? Well, the most common kinds are aspirin and ibuprofen.